so John, significant day in the Bomber Command Memorial. Yeah, the final stone laying and uh, yeah, the monument's really taking shape now, it's looking great. And of course we've got the commemoration up there to the 55,000 airmen that uh, died during the war. And uh, it, it's great to see it built at long, long last. An emotional moment? Yeah, quite, it's quite emotional. It's emotional when you think of uh, all the people that died and all the families of those people. You know, when you think of the heartache and the tragedy that was associated to uh, that scale of death, you know, it's, uh, it's a bit mind-blowing, really. And, um, you know, each one of those airmen have got hundred friend, hundreds of friends and family that would have been traumatised by the death. And no, to, have them, them, to have them now at last commemorated, I think it's a big thing and a very, very important thing for Britain. Now, it's just less than a year since the, the first piece of turf was, was dug. I mean, looking back, can you imagine, could, could you imagine something of this magnitude? Yeah, I could, because that's exactly what I expected it to be. Um, but it, it, you know, it, does, it does look spectacular, and so whilst I didn't have the imagination to see what it was going to be, um, it's fantastic to see it in the flesh, so to speak, and uh, you know, I think it's going to be a great landmark for London, and it's going to be another tourist attraction that's interesting to people, and in many cases something that's going to open people's hearts when they realise what it stands for. And we've got the dedication to come, which is going to be quite a day. Yes, June, and uh, yeah, it's going to be a massive day. Um, they were just telling me that the, the, that uh, parts of London, parts of the streets are going to be shut down. There's a lot of members of uh, the royal family coming along, and uh, there's various flight flight pasts. And I think it's just going to be a very, very spectacular day and a very, very emotional day. And finally, there's one point not many people realise that you have an uncle who was in Lancaster's. Uncle Doug, yeah. Uncle Doug was uh, in the Air Force and uh, flew in uh, Wellingtons and uh, Lancaster's.